clear and Savali can put a zero on the board. And that's the key right there is setting the tempo. So Savali will be making his uh, ninth start. Two and two coming off a start against Chicago where he was very good. He didn't get a win in that ball game. The bull, bullpen gave it up but he pitched the six innings. Only three hits allowed. One run one walk two strikeouts. And the first pitch of the game is grounded to second base. And Andres Jimenez throws out Garcia. One down. Two and two the count. He works first base side of the rubber. And the pitch. And it's swung on, lined towards medium deep center. Caught there by Miles Straw. And that is out number two. That'll bring up Salvador Perez. Now the windup and the pitch. And strength three called. Cutter on the outside corner locked him up. The Royals go in order, and the Guardians coming to bat. For Daniel Lynch, this is his sixth career start against Cleveland, and he's still shooting for his first win against the Guardians. Well, he's one of the hottest Royals starters, so let's just hope that he can shut their offense down enough. The pitch. Quan hits it on the ground towards second base. Michael Massey's there. He goes to an E, scoops it up, throws to first, and Quan's out one away. Abed Rosario drives one to deep left center field and it will get down just in front of the wall. It's fielded by Kyle Isbell, but in the second with a one out double is Ahmed Rosario. Rosario 16th double of the year. They'll have a chance to get on the board early. Here it comes and Hosey takes ball four. That was the unintentional intentional walk. First base open. They didn't want anything to do with Jose. Naylor over the last 30 games is batting 390 with 29 RBIs. There's that go. nice short swing right up the middle into center field around third. Rosario will score and the Guardians will play from in front. RBI number 62 for Nails. Oh, the oh, runner's man. got an unbelievable jump. Balk. Lynch turns and throws it to Balk. It's a balk. It's a balk. Yeah. yeah, it's a balk. Don't worry, it's a ball. That's a shame because I think they had it stolen anyway. Now, that, there's no doubt. Look at he was off and running, and then he <laughs> he just panicked. <laughs> Josh Bell, switch hitter, batting right-handed. The pitch. Bell chops it softly towards shortstop. There's almost a collision between Witt and Naylor. Witt tried to tag Naylor. Seemed like he missed him. Now Ramirez caught in a rundown. Witt throws home. Ramirez is tagged out trying to score. Bell's over at first base safely. And now the question is, did Bobby Witt Jr. successfully tag Josh Naylor? You can see Jr. with the behind the back tag, Naylor not, and then Ramirez by that time, he was in no man's land. So not a good read by Ramirez. He missed him. No challenge. Wow. Look at this. Look at that. That's unbelievable. Tag, you're red, but you missed. <laughs> Bell runs again, and Jimenez pops it up, and Lynch makes the catch. Lynch gets the final out of the first, but the Guardians do get one run. Michael Garcia will lead off the fourth inning for Kansas City. If it wasn't for the Guardians so far, Garcia would be one of the hottest rookies going. He's hit 315 against everybody else, but he's 0 for 16 wow. against Cleveland pitchers. Oh, yeah, he up and hit him in the side of the face. Those are staggering. Curveball like that, hit him right in the cheek. Chris DeLucia, one of the Royals' assistant trainers, comes out to take a look. Michael is not coming out. Crowd gives him polite applause as he stays in there with a count. One ball, two strikes. Got him looking. Fastball. Painted the outside corner. Salvador Perez out on strikes his only time up. He had him 0-2 the first time up, and then it came back to 2-2. Two and, two. and he struck him out again. First strikeout swinging for Savali tonight, but that's now five in the ball game. Here's the 0-2. Called strike three on the outside corner. Six K's on the night for Aaron Savali. Five looking. Josh Naylor leading off and a liner, and it oh, skips man. by the third baseman Garcia. How did he miss that? Well, when you're going well, that's what happens, right? Holy, he was right there. I mean, we had a perfect view of it. Maybe he didn't know if it was going to skip or catch it in the air. Here's Josh Bell. Pitch to him. Launched high and deep to left. Way back there. Bleacher bound. Home run, Josh Bell. For Bell, number nine. A two-run shot, and the Guardians are in front 3-0. We go to the seventh inning at Progressive Field. Just over 80 pitches for Aaron Savali. Nice. Came back with the heater to get him. Yes, him. he did. Yeah, I like that. I like that a lot. Strikeout number eight for Savali. 
Prado has taken a called third strike twice and last time was the most frustrating. It was a fastball right down the middle and when he was out he had slammed his bat and his helmet into the dirt. 2 2 pitch. On the outside corner called strike three a cutter just clipped the edge and Prado's down looking for a third time tonight. That's nine strikeouts for the Royals. Prado is barking with Brennan Miller. He just got ejected from the game. And now Matt Quatrero's come out of the dugout to talk to Miller. That's he struck out 93 times now. 37 look. I'd be a little upset too if Os Prado ball looked a little bit out, but now nobody's on and you, you call it out looking. That's one thing, but when there's runners in scoring position, you can't keep doing that. You have to clear that part of your mind and stay aggressive. I don't know what he's eyeballing for. And this will be pitch number 100 for Aaron Savali, who has struck out a season best nine. The payoff, a swing and a fly ball straight away center. So that'll be caught by Miles Straw, and that'll be the night for Aaron Savali. My goodness, was he brilliant tonight. Seven shutout innings. The Royals trail the Guardians 3-0, top of the ninth inning. They brought in their closer, Emmanuel Classe. He has had the electric touch this season. 37 strikeouts, 11 walks, and 40 and two-thirds innings. 24 saves in 31 tries. So he has blown seven saves, but he has been one of baseball's premier closers over the last couple of years. Bouncing ball to first. Naylor taking himself. One down. The next delivery swung on, banged up the middle, near second. Rosario flips to second one. Jimenez turns the game ending double play. Ball game. And the Guardians have climbed back to 500. 